Steven's personality completes me. We have very similar interests. We have very similar humor. We can spend hours on end just talking. He's very smart and very just <laughs> special. I can't really know much about it, I just knew that it was, uh, it's very debilitating. Guess so, when I was diagnosed, I didn't really know what to expect. Cause there was a time I was still walking and just kind of living with normal life. Just with just, uh, a little extra help. With ALS, it's something where there isn't just a test that you can take that says, you know, We've confirmed this diagnosis, so it was definitely a long road. And I think you know, in the beginning, it's it's just within your family, and so it's it's something that does bond you. Challenges, you know, really bring you closer as a family. Pretty much not knowing what to expect almost all of me, because because I would use it to by not being able to do something, I kind of learned to accept it. Versus if he take it away from me, just like that. We have a newborn now. We have a seven-month-old Eli. He was born in June of this last year, and that's added a new dynamic into our family, but we've had a lot of fun being new parents and figuring it out as we go along. It's been an interesting process learning how to be a parent on his end, but it's been a fun process to figure out how he can be involved. Go keep it out of him as a monitor, just kind of alert to your journey. With a caregiver, that you know, he's awake or he's crying or just kind of anything that I can be put in a position to assist. It's been so beautiful to watch. It's the first grandkid within our family, and Stephen is so patient. And the family that Stephen and Jenny have created with Eli has been such an inspiration to me, just in my own life, and looking at the love that they have for each other and, and the marriage that they have is something that I hold up as an ideal in my own life, and that's been really a blessing to have. Every marriage has its ups and downs, and ours is just kind of blatantly in your face. We're very happy, and we're able to show each other that we care about each other still, and able to communicate to make sure that we're feeling like our needs are met. He always wants me to know that he loves me, and he wants me to know that I'm supported, and he cares about me, and he's working on things to help me out. Well, it is debilitating. It's not impossible to live with it. You can still have a for fulfilling life. It won't define you. It's just consistent with kind of a burden that you have to trudge through. But you are able to still enjoy the other. The normal things of life, be with loved ones, be with friends, be with family. We so much appreciate the love and support. I'm just eternally grateful to be spending my life with Jenny.